Welcome back to another Unturned video. In today's video we will go on Rush Turn and we will go from just a spawn to having high tier loot, online raiding and also destroying many groups. If you guys enjoyed this video make sure to drop a like, let's aim for 200 likes. Also subscribe to not miss any future videos. Currently in my discord there is an event where you can win yourself free skins including mythicals. Make sure to join today, the link will be in the description below. Today we're giving away a blossoming snowfall at Taklovka. If you wanna win this make sure that you've liked, subscribed and comment something below. Channel members also have a higher chance of winning. Alright boys, we are on Rust Turned. I have not played Rust Turned in, in quite a while actually. Alright, so the server, I do have a few vaults. So this server is probably the most advanced Rust Turned server that there is. There's like everything working. Stuff like recyclers work, oil rigs work, everything, literally. Furnaces work. It's, uh, it's pretty cool. Server is always populated. Obviously, I am not going to be solo. If I was going to be solo, I would probably get destroyed. So I'm gonna invite a few of my friends to join. And we will see... What we get into first things first is I want to get myself as much loot as possible. I'm gonna go loot uh, this monument over here. Maybe I'll get myself a gun or something like that. That would be really, really good. And then afterwards, we uh, there should be a recycler here as well. Afterwards, we will just go and start building a base. So for today's checklist is I want to get myself a base down. I want to do an online raid. And I want to get myself workbench level 3. Get myself C4 learned. As much guns as possible learned. So we'll see what we will get into. Oh, there's a dude here. Bro, I'm dead. Oh, feels bad. I didn't really lose anything. I had nothing, yeah. yeah he could he could take my two syringes. I did manage to actually vault some stuff. I vaulted a bunch of, like, random junk. That stuff that I have to recycle. So when we get myself to recycler, I'll, I'll just do it. Right, we're close to another monument, so I'm just gonna go loot over there. Yeah, this is basically what I, I got. Nothing too crazy. Oh, there's a dude over there. Got myself a python kit. This is a free kit. Bro, where is bro going? And there we go. Hit him. Headshot. Bro, he's still not dead. Oh, he has a bow. <laughs> he's running away. Where is he going? Come back here, man. There we go. He's down. Alright, he's dead. Yeah, he had a bow. He had some tools. Nothing crazy. So yeah, as I said before, we're gonna be... I'm um, not gonna be alone. The server allows up to max 5. So we're gonna be at most 5 people. On roster and it is very impossible to go solo, especially since everybody is gonna have insane guns and we didn't join on the start of the wipe. This is like, it's been a week or more that it has wiped, so everyone's gonna have insane bases and insane loot. And here we are with pythons. I just recycler here, so I'm just gonna get to recycling. Let's pick up as much junk as possible and let's just start recycling. Try to get us, ourselves as much scrap as possible and as much frags as possible. And we got ourselves some computers as well, some rope and blades. As I said earlier, this server is quite realistic to real rust, so that means that... Yeah, there we go, it has recycled already. Yeah, let's put everything. We're gonna try to build in a location that's close to a recycler. If it's too far, then it may be a problem, so we'll, we'll see what we get. Probably we're gonna build on the snow, though, like close to here and close to airfield, like between those two locations. I think that would be a, a very OP spot. If we hear shots going on at either of them, we will just try to, to counter it. Uh, we should have gotten... Yep, we got ourselves quite a ton of frags, high coil, cloth, and even... Oil. Yeah, we're gonna have to farm a lot of scrap if we want to make ourselves the workbench level 3. It requires so much and we need to get level 1 and level 2 before so. And then we need to learn the stuff. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be a grind. Today's video is sponsored by Pine Hosting. Are you guys trying to set up your own network for Unturned? Then look no further, because I got the best option for you, which is Pine Hosting. Pine Hosting is very easy to learn, the navigation is super user-friendly and not hard at all to master. The servers all have high performance with DDoS protection. When I started my own network a while ago, I had no clue how to do anything, but after a few minutes of looking around, I learned the basics shortly. They have locations all around the world, and the pricing is super worth it. They also have a variety of game servers to choose from, including Rust, Ark, and also Minecraft. A game-changing feature is the ability to install plugins and mods by clicking once. Also, if you have a server with another provider, you don't have to worry because Pine Hosting will help you move your servers. Make sure to check out the link below and use the code LDG for 30% off and let's get straight back into the action. Alright, so it's tree chopping time and then it's base building time. We're gonna farm a lot. We probably just will do it stone for now. Oh, there's some shots going on. <laughs> we gotta be... Oh, that was actually a sentry. Okay, so there's a sentry very close to us. We gotta be careful that we do not die to it. Alright, let's build ourselves a 2x2 two two for now. 
Put an airlock, put the TC over there. Alright, lovely. Now let's just switch to walls. Oh yeah, we're get we're we're actually closer to the sentries now. I think that's that large base. Wait, I think my teammate died. Yeah, he died. Oh, feels bad. We just gotta not get too close to it, basically. And we'll be okay. Alright, let's make ourselves the roofs. I really like how clean it is to build on the server, so it's very nice. Let's make ourselves... We gotta make doors, so let's just take the scrap out of my vault. There we go, sheet metal. Alright, so our fourth teammate joined as well. And now we gotta do code locks. My teammate died again, so it feels bad. Oh, we gotta do actually codes. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Um, I'll just do 1357. It's very easy to remember. We got ourselves another teammate. He's completely naked. Has absolutely nothing either. Let's do the code lock on this. Same code. Alright, lovely. And now we just gotta upgrade all of it to stone. So that one LR won't break everything. Start upgrading it. Beautiful stone. We should have enough to build it, actually. And we should also have more than enough to put in the TC so it doesn't decay. Yeah, we're gonna have enough. We just have to do the airlock now. There we go. Oh, I made that into sheet metal by mistake. It's alright. I mean, later on, we'll upgrade it to sheet metal anyway. Alright, lovely, bro. I'm loving how the base is coming already. Let's put a code lock on the TC as well. Same code. 1357. Now let's do ourselves some crates as well. Got ourselves three crates, so that's pretty nice. Now we gotta do a code lock for each of them. But we'll do that later on. Actually, I'm gonna put these in the TC so it doesn't decay. Even though we need stone for it. And let me drop all of the items I had in my vault so that we have an empty vault. Let's put them in there. We could put the hammer as well. Eoka pistol. Oh, he farmed a lot. Oh, nice. Yeah, we could go um, recycle these then. That's actually really good. Oh, there's shots over there. Oh, yeah, there's a dude over there. There we go. Headshot. Wait. Wait, where did bro go? Oh, I thought... Wait, what is going on? Wait, I think he died. I think he had nothing and died. That's why he has no bag. I didn't get a kill. I'm so confused. Where did he go? There's a blue key card in here. I didn't even know that. Okay, well, we came here originally to recycle, so we're gonna do that. Yeah, he already put some stuff in there. And our fifth member has joined. Alright, so our group is full. Oh, he had a crossbow. Okay, that's very nice. I think this was his body and then he bled out or something. I don't know. I don't really know what happened. Alright, we got all of this. Let's put all of this junk in here now. And get ourselves quite a ton from it. Lovely. Now, we still have much more, bro. I'm actually getting quite geared quite quickly, and I'm not gonna lie. All of these is gonna give us so much scrap and high call and everything. I'll try, I'll try to make myself a full high quality base today as well. I think that should be one of the checklists. Oh, there's people. Oh, there's a duo. Oh, here's a Thompson. I'm getting pushed. Alright, one guy dead. And I'm dead. I ran out of ammo, man. My teammates are there, though, so I'll just TPA back. Killed one, though, but he may actually revive him. Oh, there's a dude right here. What's up, bro? Yeah, he's dead. I think he was downed. There's a hazmat over there. Yeah, he had Oh, this was the Tommy guy. I'm gonna push. Please don't peek. Bro, what is he doing? He's running at medding. 15 damage, what? 23 damage headshot. All right, that's crazy. Where's bro going? Come back here, boy. There we go, he's dead. Alright, but dead. Oh, yeah, the Thompson. I think it's empty. What the hell is going on with the voice chat? Alright, thankfully I had a pump, man. Let's go check if the recycler items are still there. Right, there's a loot pile here. I think this is my loot, actually. Yeah, this was my loot. That's where I died. Let's see what bro over here had. Oh, scrap. That's my python, I think. Yeah, some high quality. Yeah, this is my building plan. Yeah, that was my body. Yeah, this stuff is still recycling in there, so it should be all in there. Uh, that was very scary, actually. But we did get some Thompsons and some Hazmat, so that's really nice. We could research those. I saw a dude run in here, so I'm gonna go... Uh, try to kill him. Oh, he's right here. Oh my god, he... Bro, he hit me. I don't know how he didn't kill me, actually. Oh, he's geared. Oh my god. Yo, he has a... He has a... Chainsaw. Double barrel, a bunch of stuff that I can salvage. That's pretty nice. Yo, W pump though. That's meta because I'm currently bleeding out. Oh, there's a dude shooting us with a bow. I'm just gonna have to rush him. Hopefully he doesn't one-tap me. Yeah, I'm just gonna rush him. Screw it. Oh, I got hit. Alright, there we go. He's dead. Oh, there's another guy here. What? Where is he? He's just running away. 
I think he's naked. Yeah, he is. Oh, there's Thompsons, bro. Oh, they're right on the other side. They're behind that. Yeah, they're behind that rock. Yeah, they're just gonna camp. My my team is just rushing them, bro. They're probably gonna die. Uh, I have so much loot on me. I really need to depot this or something. I'm gonna try to go around and I'm gonna try to backstab them with the shotgun. If I get close enough, I could kill them. Let me vault all of these items first. So if I die, at least they will be safe. Let's put that scrap, oil, sulfur, and high quality. And I'm gonna go around, I'm gonna try to backstab them. Yeah, they're completely clueless. Hit him. Hit him again. Oh, this dude is dead. There we go, both dead. Yeah, MP5. Bro, why is everyone yelling? What is going on? <laughs> Alright, there we go. They're, they're all dead. Alright, so we got a workbench level uh, 2 and level 1. Still gotta get ourselves quite a ton for level 3, though. So we're gonna have to farm as much scrap as possible. We need over a thousand. And we need high quality as well, so... Yeah, it's still, still a bit of a grind. Yeah, we still have a, we still have a little bit of scrap, but definitely not enough. But with one run, we did get ourselves quite a ton of loot, so I'm really happy. We still have a lot of stuff to salvage as well. And I'm gonna make myself a few furnaces too. So let's take those, let's take the stone. Wait, do we not have... Oh yeah, we do have oil. I can make a large one. No, I'm not gonna do that though. We can make some small ones for now. So that we'll just do large ones when we can like upgrade base. Alright, so if we have any ore, I'll, I'll let it cook. Don't think we have any right now. We had some sulfur, so we could let that cook. I think it's still in my vault. Yeah. Alright, another recycling run. Gotta love ourselves uh, a lot of stuff again. We'll obviously put them all in vaults so if we die. I uh, don't lose them. I wanna give a huge shout out to the owner of the server. They actually gave me all of these vaults for free, so that's actually really nice of them to do. Uh, if you wanna check out the server, it is called Laughing Coffin. A very nice server. Wait, there's somebody around. Oh, bro, I got jump scared there. Oh no, he, he downed. Alright, so this dude is not actually teaming with us, but I guess he's being friendly with us. I'll just help him up. He was gonna join our group, but the group limit is full. And we cannot cross team on the server. Yo, a satchel. So I guess he was just roaming by, but I'm not gonna kill him anyway. Yeah, he's not gonna team with us. He can't, because we're all get banned if he does. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna... Oh, there's another dude over there. Wait, is this the same guy I just killed? Wait, I need to... Oh, I can't vault the satchel. Oh, no. Yeah, you cannot vault raiding gear. Okay. Oh, my teammate is clueless. There's a guy around. Oh, he's killing him. Oh, he killed... He killed our friendly guy, no. I mean, that's what we have to do since we cannot cross team. Alright, let me actually depot the satchel and all of these items. I don't want to die and lose it. Get ourselves a custom, though. That's really nice. We didn't have that gun yet. Where is he? Oh, he's right over here. Oh, yeah, it is the same guy. Yeah, we got a python. I'll take that ammo. Yeah, it's the same guy. He lives close, then. Because he's a solo, so he has to have a base very, very close. Oh, there's a bed over here. Maybe that's what he was coming with. No, it is not, because this bed had offline raid protection, so it's not his. There's a base over here. Oh, this could be it. Yeah, it's still being built by the looks of it. Yeah, there's loot on the floor. There's a there's a dead boy here. Alright, yeah, he's actually inside. He's just building stuff in there. We gotta mark it on the map so that if we get raiding gear, we'll come back. <laughs> Bro, they're trying to... They're trying to make him open the door. I don't think he's gonna open the door, man. Open the door, please. Open the door. Alright, so I'm gonna upgrade the base to metal sheets. We're gonna have to rotate all of that then. All of the walls. But that's alright. And now we gotta do the floors. Alright, there we go. We gotta still do the, uh, the airlock. Alright, let's rotate them. And then later, hopefully, we'll get enough HQM to actually do all of it. Alright, there we go. Now we gotta do over here. Oh, I have no more metal. Never mind, Dayo. At least the, the, two, the, the core 2x2 two two is full metal. Even though we still have more metal, but... We gotta keep some in the TC, you know? Alright, so let's put all of the scrap and put it in the TC. Actually, I can learn some stuff. Right, I'll try to learn myself enough until I get rockets and rocket launcher. I got myself some guns at least, but still don't have enough. There, we can learn hazmat and coffee helmet. Alright, not too bad. Alright, so to make a start, it's quite simple actually. But I don't think we, we practically did salvage everything in the recycler, so we can't do them yet. 
Oh, there's a dude here. Oh yeah, this is the owner of the base. I need to come out. Bro, why can't I access it? Hello? What? I can't open it. Oh well. Yeah, I literally cannot open it. What the hell? Oh, he came out. There we go, he's dead. Yeah, my teammates can loot it. Okay. Oh, he's here again. There we go, he's dead. Uh, Alright, he had a pistol and some bullets. There's another dude there. There we go, he's dead. Oh, there's another guy. Bro, he has Ioka. There we go, dead. Bro, so many people just shot out of nowhere. Alright, let's see what this dude over here had. Let's, let's heal up. I had a python and hazmat. Alright, this dude that I killed had some software. I guess my teammates looted them. If he had software, he probably had some good loot. Oh, he has a sentry inside. Yeah, he has a sentry inside. Alright. Oh, he opened. Oh, he's dead. What gun is that? Oh, that's an LR. Oh my god. I can't access his, uh, his loot. If we get to kill him with the other door open, we can try to rush in, but... I don't know if we'll be able to do that. I mean, the LR's gonna run out of ammo at some point, right? Oh, my teammate's almost dead, let's heal him up. Heal myself too, cause I'm bleeding. There's somebody else shooting us, I think. Yeah, he's dead. Alright, what? Bro brought his TC! What is he doing? Oh, the door's open. Oh, my teammate's down. You gotta heal him. There you go. I don't understand why he brought his tool cupboard. Yeah, it still has more ammo. Let's just heal up. Alright, let's stop the bleeding. Bro, I'm so confused what he's doing in there. Wait, let's see it. Bro, it is his TC. What? My guy just salvaged his TC and placed it outside. We could place the TC. We still can get in though. But we can prevent him from building and stuff, I guess. He's just gonna stay in there 100%. Oh, I think there's people back there. Yeah, there is. Hit him once. Oh, there's another dude. He's dead. There we go, dead as well. Oh, he had a pumpy. I'll take that. Oh, yeah, my teammate looted the other guy. Okay. We're starting to get our fair share of guns as well. What was that? Oh, that's the sentry. Our airdrop landed. Let's see what we got. Oh, okay. Well, jackhammer, MP5, AK. Not too bad. Could have been better, but... We'll take it. Get ourselves a scope, so... Oh, there's people in here. What? I thought the airport was clear. Yeah, let's kill him. I think there's more as well. Yeah, this dude is just screaming. He's down. Just kill him. Yeah, they're all dead. Oh, there's another dude. There we go, another hazmat. Uh, let's see what these two had. This dude had... Uh, absolutely nothing, some tools and some arrows. Now uh, this wasn't even my kill. Was this my kill? Nope. Uh, alright, yeah, this was my kill. Nothing that good though, but... Some components, I guess. An arrow, insane loot. Alright, expected better loot, but... Hey, we we'll take the kills. There's another let that boy here. Nothing though. Bunch of junk. So we did leave that dude, by the way. We're just gonna wait until we get uh, some charges and then we're just gonna raid them. If he's online, even better. He tried to door camp us, failed tremendously. We tried to door camp him, but he has a sentry. And he's just hiding inside now. So we'll just wait until we get some C4 and then we'll raid him. If he has turrets with LRs, he probably has some good loot in that base. Right, so we're just gonna farm, try to get as much scrap and components as possible. And then, yeah, we'll go back. We'll go back and try to see what we can get from it. Bro, each recycling run we're doing, we're getting so much junk. It's so easy to get high tier loot on this, it's insane. I think there's someone. Oh yeah, there is. Yeah, he's right under me. I'm gonna jump on him. There we go, he's dead. Oh, I had some scrap salvaged axe. I'll actually take that, that's actually really nice. We needed those, we didn't have those yet. Alright, very good. Where's the dude there? There we go, he's dead. Let's see if bro had anything. I had a pistol, a leather. Oh my god, we needed that. We can research it finally. Alright, there we go. Thank you very much. Alright boys, that's going to be it for episode 1. Now episode 2, we will continue with much more intense stuff. If you guys want episode 2 to come out tomorrow, make sure to drop 100 likes. If we reach 100 likes in the first 24 hours, I will post part 2 tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!